When the moon is high in the sky and love hits you like a big pizza pie, it's amore. I, I can't sing work crap. But welcome to another installment of Ready in Minutes. Um, I'm going to uh, cook for you today. Well, kind of cook. A pizza. Right. A pizza. Now, pizza. Mm-mm-mm. Good. You know, sometimes you're like, you're home, you're like, ah, oh, shit, what, oh, excuse my language, ha, huh. uh, what am I going to have to eat? And you're like, oh, I should order a pizza, or, oh, I should do this. Well, you know what? Ordering a pizza is going to be 10, 12, 13 bucks. You're just like, oh, what a, uh, you know, so what I have here, what I am going to say, hey, try, is a cheap way to to make a great pizza. So, what we're going to do is start off with a plate, of course, because you always have to have a plate. Because you can't put the pizza on whatever. So, but anyhow, uh, what we're going to do is we're going to use one of those store-bought freezer red freezer pizzas. The cheap kind. I mean, they're like a dollar for ten or something like that. I'm using Tostino's ha, product advertisement, not. Nah. But this is what I'm going to be using as our base. The Tostino's Crisp Crust Party Pizza Triple Cheese. It's just to start off, but we're going to make this pizza something better than just cheese. So we're going to open up this box here. We're going to take out the pizza. It's all nicely wrapped in one of those stupid cellophane things. We gotta get that off. So, ugh, give me a second here to pry that all off. And what you're gonna have here is a nice, delicious, frozen pizza. Mm. Can't wait to have this. So this is what we're gonna make for dinner today for you guys. So, <clears throat> you're like, whoa, hey, how are you gonna make that any better? Well, I'm gonna tell you how to make it better. There's some toppings you can add to this. And matter of fact, they're pretty good toppings. First topping I'm going to put on is some salad confetti. You're like, salad confetti? What is that? So this is salad confetti. It's uh this is made by Ready Pack. You might have other brands elsewhere in the universe where you might be. And inside the salad confetti you're gonna have cabbage, celery, carrot, radish, broccoli, cauliflower, bell pepper. This makes a good pizza topping. So what we're going to do is we're going to open it, grab a little handful. Oh yeah, make sure you wash your hands before you handle all this food like I did. And then you're just going to spread it on the pizza. Spread it on. La 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 la. Now some people like a lot of veggies on their pizza. Some people like a little bit of veggies. But this is about an average for me. This is how much I like on it. But wait, I'm not done yet. I'm going to be adding something else. Mushrooms! Ah! Do, 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 do. No, not those kind of shrooms. They're not the kind of mushrooms that are going psychedelic. Just your normal store-bought mushrooms. You know, I like putting them on pizza as well. Just scatter them around your pizza. Make a happy face if you want. Make I don't care what you do. You know, make it fun. You know, this is really something fun for the kids to do, too. They can make their own little mini pizzas like this, and they can enjoy it for dinner. What a great idea. Um, so that's how I have it. See, But now, if you're the kind of person that likes a little bit of meat with your pizza, like I do, there's something good you can try. You can always get some of that pepperoni or um, you can actually even pick up like a Slim Jim and chop it up. It's kind of, eh, it's okay. But I like this, especially with veggie pizza. The chicken breast cuts from Oscar Mayer. They're really awesome. What we're going to do is open it up and put some on the pizza. Just put them all around the pizza here. Because this will be like an awesome little veggie pizza. You know, uh, kids get their meat, you get your meat, whatever. I mean, it's just delicious. You're kind of like, ooh. 
but you know what? It's so good. You just like it's mouth watering. I just you know can't believe how good it is. And that stupid screensaver kicked in when I was taping. I should have turned it off. But man, oh, yum. Mmm. We're almost done here with all the chicken, so I'll just put the rest on. Alrighty. Now, this is your pizza. Looks very tasty. So what we're going to do now is, kids, if you're going to be doing this, get your mommy and daddy permission first because you're going to have to use the oven. So let's see. This calls for, um, let's see, cooking directions right there. Um, 450 degrees in the oven, center rack, nothing underneath it. Um, 12 to 13 minutes. Now, since you did put extra topping on, I do recommend that you put it in there for at least 15 minutes. Um, this makes sure that everything gets cooked properly. Uh, no cold or mushy center or anything like that. Because sometimes you can get that. It's kind of like, ugh. So, what I'm going to do is uh, go ahead and toss this in the oven. And I'll be back here within 15 minutes uh, to... Uh, show you how it turned out. Mm. See you soon. Hey guys, welcome back. It's been 15 minutes and I took the pizza out of the oven. It was hot, so uh, kids, if you're still playing with the stove, make sure you had mommy and daddy's permission or their help. Because, ooh, you don't want to burn your fingers. Ooh, your little fingers, ow! So this is what it came out like. Mmm. Mmm, 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 it smells so delicious. Alrighty. Well, so this is your pizza. Now, there's things you can have with it, you know, soda if you want, uh, salad if you want. Because what's really cool with this, what you can do is cut it up into half, into four slices, you know, two for you, two for somebody else, or one for yourself if you want. Um, but, uh, you can also cut it up into strips. Now this is fun for the kids. Cut it up into strips. Get some ranch dipping sauce on the side and they can dip that right in. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure they'll like that. But uh, um, yeah, so have fun with it. Be creative with dinner time. Make dinner time fun. So this has been another installment of Ready in Minutes and I'm your host, Junkie FX. And I'll see you here next time. Ah. Mm, 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 mm. Mm. Ooh, it's so good. <laughs>